well what a night we have had an absolute ball so i've been um to celebrity juice with a friend of mine i've just got in now so i've had a very long day because of course i've done a full shift on television this morning but i've got a late shift tomorrow so i get to lie in i'm also going to see my lovely friend who is um uh, adopting a son and i can't wait to see him and his little boy tomorrow um anyway we have had one immense night it has been so funny so we've been to see celebrity juice thank you to lisa thank you to also to tyler as well uh, for looking after us and we have the purple wristband so we were vip guests so we got to go into the green room afterwards what a you like that look at that that's the nice easter egg that landed on me this weekend <laughs> um anyway uh i don't know whether it might be stress from boo could be do you think i don't know um yeah it's been so funny i mean i have laughed and barely laughed my head off um and we got to have um uh, a quick chat with james morrison he is well cool a really cool guy um really lovely uh I i'm a bit useless i'm kind of since i stopped with as much singing i'm totally out of it so i'm a bit useless and then um uh he sang one of his songs and then i know that one <laughs> and then juliet my friend played a couple of others i thought oh yeah i know that um they've been on when i've done um sometimes when i've done breakfast on heart <laughs> so um but really lovely guy I said my hair smelled of um pantene i don't know whether to take that as a compliment or not anyway um yeah, really great night. I'm off to bed now because I'm absolutely shattered. I'm in my digs, you know, where I stay because I'm back on television tomorrow. Then I go home tomorrow night and then I've got to go and pick up those 30 Easter eggs for Frankie Jack's Willy Wonka's party. But, um, yeah, take a look at this. This is just a little clip that I took um, from today and some of the photographs, or should I say from this evening. And, uh, yeah, um, I couldn't, you can't film. I'm not going to tell you anything about it um, because obviously that's going to give it away. But it was extremely funny, as you would expect. Now, I don't get starstruck um, with anybody because I have the same thing that I think, right, we all come out of the same hole, we all go into the same hole, and it doesn't matter what you do. Um, I couldn't care less whether you were a, 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 a cleaner or Celine Dion. It doesn't matter to me. However, there's one person that's been on my bucket list that I've always wanted to meet, and that was Keith Lemon, believe it or not. That's why I wanted to go to Celebrity Juice, because I've never really sat in an audience, not that I can think of, um, for anything. Oh, yeah, I did. I did the right stuff. I did. Um, that was many years ago, wasn't it? That was many years ago. Um, so I basically, um, I've wanted to go, because um, obviously we've got these tickets for free, and uh, really wanted to go and watch Celebrity Juice and really wanted to meet Keith Lemon. I never thought I was going to meet Keith Lemon tonight. I never realised we had a VIP guest passes. I just thought it was just seats we had and we found out later. Plus, um, a wonderful, beautiful girl that I used to work with on bid, uh, Sonia, was flooring the show. So I was really um, shocked and it was so lovely to, uh, to see her. And I wish you all the best, Sonia, for when you go over uh, to Italy because she's going to be doing floor managing for a big TV show out there. Not out there, but it's back for the UK. And uh, yeah, what a night. So uh, I'm going to just give you little snippets because obviously it's very, very difficult when you're in that environment and I certainly don't want to go and get kicked out. So um, I keep it very low, but I was laughing a lot, so you could have heard my voice. <laughs> you might hear that when it comes on. But I think I'm going to be in the telly, Mum. I think I'm going to be on the telly because uh, we were in the audience. Anyway, I'll see you on telly tomorrow. <laughs> but this is what went on. Wait, is it skip? Um, we're outside, if you can see it, it says quiet please. This is my mate Juliet. Uh, we are outside, we've just been to see Celebrity Juice. Now, I've never really been in the audience for anything before. Um, really not it bothered about brilliant. it. But it was bloody brilliant. We got tickets um, through um, a makeup artist that I know. And we're actually at Elm Street now. And uh, then we've been in the green room afterwards. Where Elizabeth Grant started. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And we've met um, Keith Lemon. That's been on my bucket list, I swear to God. All my life I've wanted to meet him. If I don't see you through it week, I'll see you through it window. <laughs> Amanda um, Holden. Amanda Holden. Oh my gosh, so lovely. A beautiful figure, stunning girl, and just an amazing personality. Uh, we also met, who was the other one that said that my James hair Morrison. smelled like Pantene? James Morrison. We've just met him. Who else? Did we, who else? Who, who was the other one that was stood outside that we also met that just wandered off? <laughs> obviously, obviously we, we made an impression on him. <laughs> 
Um, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget the subscribes down here. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. I think we're going out here. The miserable security guards on the on the door here. But this is basically Elstree. Oh, in fact, you can see it here. You can see it here. Elstree Studios. Um, I think we need a picture here. It's like my sleeve, and it's it's your sleeve. Um, yeah, so we're just going out here. See ya! Nice. Oh, he's all right. He's got personality. The other one didn't. <laughs> well, he did. He's just not a nice person. But he was nice. Yeah, he had a personality, <laughs> but not a nice person. In fact, I think Amanda Holden's just walking back down there now with all her... I am absolutely positive I knew her PA. I'm telling you. I don't forget her face. I've definitely met her before. But I don't know whether... She, she, I mean, yeah. yeah, it was bugging me. Anyway, we've had a fabulous night. We're about to go back to Tesco's. Um, we're actually going to go and buy something because we've been parked on there. But we think we're probably going to get done and all. <laughs> Aren't we? Mackie D's. Oh, I can murder a Mackie D's. When you look at those girls' figures in there, you think, no, no. they don't eat Mackie D's. <laughs> <laughs> they definitely don't eat Mackie D's. Yeah, she's coming down there. I think they're having photographs taken. No, she wouldn't have photographs that she's down there is um but yes yeah, stunning isn't she so we've had a great night um i'm going to show you some pictures now because we've got some pictures i think you've got some on your phone haven't you yeah, sure. um oh my god it's so funny there's some cracking bits i can't tell you obviously because that would spoil it but you've definitely got to watch it it's when amanda holden and paddy mcginnis are the two uh, team um captains if you will and it was so funny and i think juliet and i may be in the audience i don't think they got us when we were sat down in the main part but i think they, they got, got us outside. when we were outside so you may see us in the audience as well but that's one of the funniest things i've seen lovely guy lovely girl amanda holden as well we've had a cracking night haven't we Brilliant. Nice. um free alcohol guess who's driving <laughs> <laughs> guess who's driving. driving yeah we're both driving tonight so none of us could have had a drink the, the nearest we've had to having a little bit of naughty stuff is Red Devil, just to keep ourselves awake. Because um, obviously we've been working long shifts and we're back now. I'm back on Ideal tomorrow. Anyway, walking back to our car now. I will see you tomorrow. Bye. Say, see you later. See you Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Here's all the photos um, for our, our amazing time. And I'll see you tomorrow.